going to, uh, I think I'm just going to put the camera over the top, see, see what we see. Hi guys, I'm here with you uh, today with a new exploration from the Tampa Bay area of Florida of an abandoned trailer park. So let's uh, take a look around. See what we find. You can see there's a lot of debris in this one. We won't be walking around in there, obviously. And the exits are on there for uh, demolition crew. So these will all be demolished. So I'm glad I got in here to get this documented now. You can imagine how excited I was when I saw this. I, mean, I was so thrilled to see this abandoned trailer park just sitting out in the open like this. And this is, uh, there's two rows here. This is the first row, so we'll, we'll start off going down it. And you can see the siding is off this trailer. Just kind of fell off there. And very exposed to the elements. There's a bed left in there. And a pink kitchen. You can see they all have excess on them. Oh, there's a cat in the window. Do you see it on the right there? Oh, he just jumped down. Well, at least the cats have a place to stay. That's oh, looking pretty rough. Let's uh, step up in here. Hold on a sec. Okay, there's a kitchen. Pretty moldy, and some furniture left behind. And this is looking back at that trailer. I don't see the feral cat anywhere. And every tree is taped off, uh, probably so the demolition crew leaves those alone when they demo the trailers. Maybe they're gonna turn the property into parkland or something similar. I don't really know what they're gonna use it for. And that registration here is uh, expired in 2003, along with what looks to be the rest of it expired a long time ago. Look at that dead tree in there and the moldy cupboards at the back. And this is the center area between the two roads. And the pool used to be here. And uh, it was backfilled in the summer of 2017. You can actually see it in the yeah, satellite view. And don't you just love the way they painted the, uh, the rules on the side? It's funny. Well, this would be like the, the office building and pool house and maybe even a clubhouse here. Let's go in and take a look. Might need a flashlight here. Of course, you got your typical taggers. I also should uh, let you know I uh, got a new camera. It's a Sony Action Cam 4K. So you'll probably see a, a shadow of it. Uh, it's nothing in here. There it is there. Wow, it looks like I'm holding a gun. <laughs> Well, at least I don't have the same focusing issues with this one. My last one was horrible for focusing. And it looks like they emptied it out pretty much. Well, nothing in there. Oh, there's so some creamers in there, some coffee creamers. Other condiments there. Spider's crib. Hmm. Red everywhere. Maybe the name of a taxi company or something. Coming into another little room here. Looks like baking soda with coffee mate. Own oh, paper towel holder there. That's been a little mini kitchen.
Oh yeah, there's some plumbing there. Still a bowl there. Is that a Bible over there? Looks like the size of one. Lots of spices. <laughs> oh yeah, someone liked their religion and spices. Love the way the pages are blowing in the wind there, look at that. Wow. Wow, it looks like they cleaned out this, the offices in here and just kind of threw everything here in the center. Something here. Oh! There's a cat! Hi, sweetie! Oh, you're so cute! Look at his eyes! He's not even afraid of me. I wonder if they're uh, cats that were left behind from the residence or if they're just feral cats. The toilet's not smashed. And looks like a couch. Bye, baby! 3A. Could it be units? Maybe it was like a little motel or something as well, or like little apartments. So there's some flour, something in behind here. Uh, smoothie mix. Hmm. This is almost identical to the uh, little kitchen area at the front of the building. Because we're at the back of the building now. Except for this room, it's much bigger. Big blue room here. Looks like a bathroom here. Oh, <laughs> I wonder if that's a little bathroom symbol they made. Looks pretty grungy. Oh, wow. Look, they left some stuff behind here on the shelf, like shampoo or something. Body washes. Razors. Yeah, there's a, there's a shower, but I don't know what that is. Ooh. I wouldn't be surprised if some uh, vagrants are still living here, actually. So I probably don't want to hang around here too long. There's a scotch guard in the medicine cabinet. Let's see what's to say. I loved you yesterday. I love you still. I always will. I always will. Oh, always have. I always will. I have a closet here. And utility blades just hanging on the wall here. Yeah, see how they cl it's pretty clean in here. Hmm. Over here is another part of the building. And it looks like it might have been the office, judging from the desk there. Let's take a look in here, see what we have. Okay, entering this little room here, full of stuff. Oh, there's a children's book there. Some other books over here. I wonder if this was almost like a little library for the park. Left to Die, God's Will, a lot of religious stuff in here. Cake batter mix, styrofoam plates or paper plates, whichever. And good old hangers. Quite a combination of stuff in here. Uh, no one by law should leave office without receipts. Looks like a possible maintenance room with all these uh, jugs of paint here. Assuming it's paint. Bathroom? Probably a bathroom for the office staff. Oh wow, look at the mold down there. A smashed toilet. Could have a smashed toilet and a smashed sink. Wow, that's crazy. Oh, look at all the clothes. 
wonder if they took those out of the trailers. And on the floor here, there's a lot of stuff here. Some pictures unit, 41. Something from Star Wars or Star Trek. Some bookkeeping uh, receipt books here. Book here, Lisa Scottaline, accused. And somebody's sweater left behind. And looking back, looks like a thrift store. Oh, wait, there's some files here. Let's just say here. A lot 28 moved over here. Unit 41 pictures. Looks like they took a lot of pictures of the uh, units. Uh, maybe when they evict them, they take pictures just to... Uh, uh, I assume a lot of them are rented out, so maybe they uh, just to keep the, the damage deposit. So there's even more here. It's full of files. Wow. This place is unbelievable. And then we come out of there. We come into another sort of pass-through area here, full of debris again. I, I'm sure that the demolishers and the demolition crew, whatever, have piled that all up. And then you come in here and, hmm, looks like it was almost another, like an actual unit that someone lived in. Polar pop over here next to the bathroom <laughs> and um, it's like a, it's like a kitchen floppy fan this is at the very back of the building here looks like they dug up a lot of floor Oh, that was probably a bathroom there because there's a vanity on its side with a toilet. It looks like flooring there. And there's the plumbing for a little kitchen. So maybe like a little motel unit almost. Like a, I don't know, kitchenette type thing. And then back out through the, the walk-through here, area here. The second walk-through area, I believe. Oh, they must have had vending machines because look over here, there's a change machine here. So it must have been the uh, vending machine area also, almost like a little motel. Yeah, like a little motel inside of the uh, trailer park. God, these rooms go on forever. You could get lost in here. Okay, this is like a regular kitchen here now. So I don't know if it's part of the other unit or if this is another, or if this is a different unit. Pass through window there. Let's see if there's anything inside here. One sec. Well, oh, spices and just spices. Nice. <laughs> um, maybe the dining room here. Looks kind of like a dining room or living room. And another bathroom. There's lots of little poof things there. And razors. The last bathroom had a bunch of razors in it too. Now I recall. Maybe a little air conditioner unit there. Oh, they love this blue paint. It's another blue room. It's got like a closet in it. So I guess the bedroom portion of this unit. Maybe the people that uh, owned it lived here. Okay, we'll go through this walk through here again because there was one more trailer at the end of this first road here 
that I want to take a look at. I'll get through all this stuff here. <laughs> it's that one there. Let's go take a look. Okay. A lot of branches on the ground. Well, it's not too bad considering the others, really. And that's the back side of the buildings that we were just in. The building. It felt like buildings because there were so many rooms. And then this is, wraps around to the other street. And the building we're just in is off to the right here. We've explored all of that. I just want to make sure we haven't missed anything. Actually, this place has uh, only been abandoned about a year. It was uh, February of last year. 2018 actually that the uh, uh, developers actually had the water all capped off on most of the units. There's one unit left here at the very end or one that's on one lot at the very end. But they have a uh, notice to, uh, to leave. So they're probably waiting for them to leave before they finish their, dem their demolition. Unless they ran out of funds, it's hard to say. It's been kind of just sitting here, like, unloved. Just like these trailers. Oh wow, look at that. Things are still kind of intact here. All that paneling there. And there's a structure over here. I don't know what they use this for. You can see the pads there where the trailers, where some other trailers used to be. It was a full park at one time. I know when I look at the satellite view, there's, it was full. So I don't know if the other trailers were actually pulled out or demolished. Oh, another cat. Oh, look at him. He's cleaning himself or herself. It's like the third one we've seen today. Oh, he just, he got spooked and he just jumped. Kind of scared me too. It's another tree with the uh, tape around it. You can see the um, pads there. Oh wow, that, this one's really piled up with debris. We won't be going inside there. And this one, oh wow, this is really rough. sides have all fallen off. They're laying on the ground and oh look all the furniture back here just piled up. Oh my god look at that. And this is the last trailer on this row and hmm looks like a vagrant's been living in here or was maybe still is. Got a little apartment set up here. All that food and drinks. It's probably their sleeping area. Hard to say if they're still here or not. Look at the old curtains.
windows pushed in here. Whoa, it's windy out here. I gotta order a muff for this thing. And that brings us back to the beginning. Actually, I'm gonna check out this one last trailer here. There's a, the back end, looks like somebody may have been staying in it. I won't be able to get in. I'm just going to, uh, I think I'm just gonna put the camera over the top to see what we see. Okay, hopefully nobody was in there. I don't think so. I don't hear anybody around here. And uh, I think it's pretty much more the same. So I'm just going to say goodbye here. And uh, thanks for watching. I love you guys and see you in the next video.